What's up, everybody? Welcome back. I'm XGP here in Argentina. Uh, one of my favorite tracks on the circuit, so hopefully we're going to have a good day. Oh, I jumped the gate. Is it bad that I can just cut over here and be in second? The big thing is uh, Olsen's not up front right now, so we need to... Go. <laughs> go get Hoffer. Get this lead. And uh, hopefully we can gain some points on uh, Olsen today. After him going 1-1. Not ideal. Hoffer's gonna give us a tough fight here, though. Uh, why are you pushing me wide, dude? God. Okay, Olsen's in second. <laughs> wow. Good for him, though. I like that he's actually up here. Like I said before, this game's proving me wrong right now, so that's good. <laughs> it's like, they always, like, have a weird day. Like, I remember being in the 450 class on the Xbox, and, uh, I would usually battle, like, Crowley or whoever, and, uh, they would just have a random 12th place, like, overall finish, not even just a moto, and it was just awful. Decent first lap here. This will be the first lap that's uh, actual lap time, though. Seems like Olsen's having some uh, competition back there. And I'm screwing up these corners. <laughs> Honestly, if we can stay in the lead, which is ideal, and then Harap could beat uh, Olsen, that'd be huge for us. But Olsen's been really on his game lately, so I don't really see that happening. the line I usually take. I like taking the inside there. Got a little bit of a lead. Not too big, but big enough to give us a little bit of breathing room at least. Again, Argentina, I think this is one of the better tracks on the circuit. Uh, I always feel very fast here. Ooh, Wilson just went down. Not good. I think the worst finish I've seen Olsen is, I think, possibly that sixth place he had a round or two ago. I don't remember. All the races are starting to look very similar. <laughs> and I crashed. Overcorrected on that one a little too much. It's alright. Happens. Still got a second gap on him. Looks like Hoffer is back there. It's weird that we, you know, rode KTM for a race, and I was just like, no, this, this isn't me. I'm a Honda boy. Had to get back on my Honda. Ever since we left KTM, KTM's, like, been really bad. Usually they're up here. Hoffer, it's kind of mid-pack. Oh, not mid-pack, but, uh, I'll say top 5 to top 10. And I feel like Tommy Vialli, I've battled with him for championships before in this game. Got Harrison up here again. It's good to see. He's having a good year. Olsen already back up to third. Crawford too. Crawford was battling with us uh, last round. It's good to see. Olsen going 1-1 could have been two rounds ago too. But from this uh, round, I can't remember. I feel like Olsen's almost already in the lead. Uh, we're not going to quite get the two-lap card. We're going to have to do three laps. If it's close, I can check up, but it's not going to be close. Oh, that's a big mistake. I would really like to get the 2 up card, but... 
you know how that goes. Oh, dude, it's gonna be so close. Okay. I was able to check up just enough to get that, and now we got Olsen on our ass, so we got two apps to deal with Olsen. Hopefully we can get this lead extended out again. There's four bikes maybe right behind me. Might not have been a great decision, but we get one last lap to hopefully not make a big mistake and cost us too much. Pull it back to a second, about a second there, but he's kind of hanging out. Ooh, couldn't get that roller. I was trying to single out of that roller, but couldn't quite get it. That's alright. It's been a good moto, though. Ooh. God, I have an itch on my lip, and it's like the worst time. Could definitely use a moto win. Haven't we haven't won a moto or an overall in like a while? We only have two on the year. Could really use like a one one day. We <coughs> could use a one one day, but honestly, at this point, we could just use an overall win. Really needs something. <laughs> I'm gonna get the one lap to go. The white flag. Here. That was a good lap. 36.8. That's not too bad. Got a four second lead on them. Olsen fell back to third, which is good for us. That would give us five points to shorten that gap to uh, in the points lead. Which is good. Uh, I think it's just me and him. Me and him are kind of pulling away from everyone else. I know uh, Jed there was doing well, but I haven't heard anything about Jed this moto, so. If I remember, we'll have to see how Jed does. He had a good round last round. Ooh. Ooh. I'm so lucky I didn't get a track cut there. I had to sneeze. I'm really happy that I have a mute button right on my headset. I could just press it, sneeze really quick, and press it again. It's pretty convenient. Need new games to stream, guys. So if anyone is watching this and has a game they want to see me stream, definitely uh, leave a recommendation. Probably should do another Cart Mechanic Simulator. I was doing those a lot, and then I stopped. I don't even know why I stopped. I think I got sidetracked with college basketball, honestly. But, nevertheless, huge Moto 1 win. Uh, we are trying to get into GTA uh, RP, so we'll, we'll see how that goes. Uh, excuse me. Alright, Olsen fell to third, which is really good, but this is what I mean. Jed's, like, third or fourth in the championship points. I don't. He's not in the top ten. Like, Tommy Vialli, 12th. Jed, 17th. He got four points. That's crazy. Oh, my God. What happened? Just makes no sense. Yago's up here. Huh. Very strange. We're in the fastest lap time. 36.8 was us. 36.6 Olsen. Okay. That makes sense. Me and him are quite a bit of head and pace compared to everyone else. So. That's okay. Hopefully we can uh, get a really good second moto. Maybe go 1-1 one, one for the first time. I think first time this year. Possibly second. We might have done it early in the year. Can't remember. Alright. Pick uh, gate number one. Hopefully we can get a good start. Yeah, that's a lot better start this time. 
Big hole shot. The power of that back wheel. I think we should change up the gear setup. Maybe work or something a little darker. Next few races. Really good start. Oh, I'm assuming Olsen's like right behind us. No, it's actually, I think that's Harup. It's a good start from him. I think Olsen got uh, pushed to the back of the pack a little bit. Good start to Moto2. Hopefully we can uh, keep it up. Like I said, uh, confidence wise and just point wise, we could really use an overall on the middle of the box and uh, I think we got one the other, yeah we did, we went 2-1 uh, and we got one, but we haven't had a 1-1, one, one. I really don't think we've had one all year, like I said, I may have had one early in the season, but I don't think so, can't quite remember. This video might technically be shorter just because uh, we did 5 laps instead of 6. If I run a certain pace this moto, though, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> we'll probably run six this moto. Because if I run a faster pace than last moto, we won't uh, get the two-lap card. We'll get the timer run out right after we finish, cross the finish line. I mean, if it's close like last time, I'll check up a little bit. I don't want to check up too much. Lose my lead, you know. Could have cost us, but lucky it didn't. I don't like that inside hump. It's a big stretch to get into that first roller, and it just it's a weird angle. It can really kick you off the bike, so. Oh. Could not slow down, because my tires went on the ground, so I could not get the bike planted, but that's all right. Let's keep on pushing. We know we're in the lead. Hopefully, Olsen's not in second. We can get some points on him today. Would like to get that red plate on this bike. There and square this time, you know. I'd like to not have to go into the last round uh, battling out with Olsen, but I don't know. The way the season's gone, <laughs> looks like that's going to be the case. It's been a good, it's been a really good, fun season. Uh, very competitive. 19 rounds, more than, uh, that's the other thing. 2021, like, doesn't have all the rounds or something. I don't know, it was like 13 races. It was weird. I like the long season. Huge outdoors fan. I think 20's tracks are just built a little better. Uh, physics are just better in my opinion. 38.7. Somebody just broke it. <laughs> yeah, I gotta put the hammer down. Need to start running a little faster lap times. Because Olsen's running pretty quick times. He's definitely gonna... Start catching me if I'm not careful. <laughs> uh, still like sick, man. I mean, by the time I post this, I might not be sick, but they just my stuff gets pre-recorded. If I have a day or so, whatever. Come on, I gotta stop doing that. That right there is what's killed my lap time. I don't see Olsen in that little group of three there, so. Because that's good for us. He's about 6th or 7th, looks like. Yeah, definitely not going to get the uh, 2 lab boy this time. Uh, way too big of a time difference. There's still 10 seconds. Oh my god. Making a lot of dumb mistakes right now. I'd like to put down a really good lap, but... 
Especially I need to, I really need to keep this lead, take advantage of also not having a good moto, being about fifth. You know you're a championship contender when you consider fifth place a bad moto. <laughs> so we'll do three more laps here. Only in the whole race, but just I can feel them closing in. <laughs> Almost got booted over there again. I don't know how Olsen works, so I know oh, obstacle avoided. Oh come on, it's a late. It's probably hurt. I'm probably. Mm, I don't know even know what to say there. That's pretty wild. Looks like Olsen possibly just made a pass for fifth or fourth. Hard to say. Harrison just went down, so that might have just put Olsen in third. Got Crawford behind me. I like seeing Crawford back there, man. It's very uh, underrated rider. He's had some good finishes here last couple motos. Interesting to see. It's another thing we should probably look at is uh, where Crawford is at the championship standings because I feel like he's doing pretty good I mean he's had some podiums maybe not podium overall but some podium races so come on stop sliding all over the place come on he's kind of hanging around with me so When I was thinking, I was like, oh, I was going to ride a Suzuki for the uh, 450 division. It'd be like Ryan Dungey or whatever, because I was thinking of using number five. But I don't think this game has Suzuki's in it. Could go KTM, but like you guys know, I don't like KTM. And technically, I think Dungey's riding Honda for the outdoors he's doing this year. So I guess that's one way to look at it. Could just keep on the Honda. Could go Kawasaki. Could also go to number two, Ryan Velpoto. Not a huge Velpoto fan. Uh, I definitely rooted for Dungey in those battles. Um, also a big fan of Chad Reed. I always loved Chad Reed. Thought he was good. Just got an achievement. Don't know what that is. Like, I don't know what that one is. I know what an achievement is. <laughs> Fastest lap time. Olsen's gonna break it. <laughs> He's gonna come through and like set this crazy lap time. Uh, front end nose dive there. <clears throat> but Crawford's like really like hanging around, man. Looking down at the mini map, he's like keeping the same distance between us. Pretty good. Good ride for him. Nice little second place here in Moto 2. Feel good to get a 1 1 for us. Really like to get that championship lead here soon. Can breathe a little bit. Also, is just really good, man. Interesting to see where he's at today. Uh, yeah, Crawford. I don't even see him over there. I think I counted five or six bikes, so. Outside the top five for Olsen. Moto 2. Definitely not ideal. And I think we even. Because I think he fell to third, didn't he? How am I op. How am I avoiding that obstacle? Like, the line I accidentally took, like, kicked me in the air. It would have hurt me more if he just let me land. I don't know. Nice win. Feels good to get that 1-1. Uh, one, one. Let's see. All right. Okay. 36-8-3-2. Nathan Crawford is doing really well. Olsen fell to 8th. 
Not a good day for him. We go 1-1 and gain 17 points on Olsen. Crawford had a really good day. Got third overall. That's awesome to see. All right. Middle of that box, championship standings. One point separates the two of us. That's crazy. Ah, oh, Crawford. Crawford's a ninth. That's crazy. All right. Jed got 12 points today. <laughs> that's cr that's wild. Yeah, that's just like I said, it's way more. Well, but yeah, it's championship. It's getting interesting. One point separates us, so. Might be good getting that red point next time. But appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Till next time. Peace.